Welcome back to my channel. Today I am unboxing my new Dyson V7 Motorhead Origin vacuum cleaner. I just got this for Black Friday. Um, I have been wanting one of these and it was a really great deal. I could not pass it up and I ordered it off of walmart.com. It was $1.79. And they have a great new feature now where if you buy it, you can actually pay in installments through, it's called a firm pay. Um, you just sign up for that and you can make monthly installment payments. I thought that was kind of perfect for me. I don't really like to spend a lot of money at one time. I really like to save money. So this actually makes it perfect to buy something like this, make smaller payments, but still get it now, pay it off later. Kind of like layaway, but you get to use the product now. So... We're going to go ahead and open this up. It's my first time ever having a Dyson. Um, the current vacuum I use is a Bissell. I don't even remember. We've had it for such a long time that I honestly don't even remember what it is. It's, I know it's a Bissell, but it's just really, really old. So we're going to open this up now. If I can figure out how to open it. My cats are now interested in what's going on, of course. Just gotta be right there. Okay, I'm back. We're having a little bit of technical difficulties getting the top part open, but now here we are. We got it open. So I'm gonna just throw things. I did vacuum earlier with my Bissell, but I have children and I have a husband. That means that it already needs to be vacuumed again, which I'm totally fine with because I get to use my new. Dyson vacuum. I've been waiting for this. I, as soon as I got the email that this was ready to go, I had to rush into town to pick it up. So here is the handheld portion of it. Super excited to use this. Cannot wait. I'll leave everything attached so I can read it. Let me leave that over here. Okay, this is the rolling head of it. Okay, so here's the actual vacuum part of it. Um, I wasn't able to choose the color that I wanted. I wanted like a pink. Um, so this one is like a, it's like a bluish purple color, which is it's fine. I'm not against, I'm not against it. I just, I really wanted the pink one, but you know, Walmart only had this one. So this is what I got and it's going to be fine. I'm going to keep telling myself that it's going to be fine. It's beautiful either way. It is a very beautiful vacuum and I just, I watched my favorite um clean with me videos and they all have this vacuum and i just love the way it cleans and it goes seamlessly throughout the home and i just knew i had to have the same thing and with making monthly payments on it that makes it even better and don't mind if i'm reaching a lot i am very short so i might look silly having to reach in but because I have little arms. Little manual brush, which is perfect because like I said, I do have pets and my pets like to get on the couches, which I just vacuumed with my Bissell earlier today. And I know you can't tell, but I did. Um, you couldn't see how much fur was on there. It was a lot. I should have recorded it, honestly, but I didn't. So now I am going to pause, read the instructions, put it together. So I'm back, got the instructions out looks really simple to put together so i'm kind of hoping it is because i really want to start using it as soon as possible looks like i literally just click it all together couldn't be um any simpler than that and i really do love the emptying out design to clean it out that is just going to be amazing the easier it can be the better So you click in and then click in. Let's try it. 
like this goes in here. Probably like this, maybe. Very simple, easy, I like it. This is the other portion that is supposed to just click on. Okay, easy. 20% charged, charge fully before use. So I am gonna try to charge a little bit here, um, or I mean use it for a little bit. High suction, max. And then it's just simple release to empty it out. I really like that a lot. Oh, it came on. All right, so I'm going to set this up to use it. I'm gonna clean up the little mess I made because I am working on cleaning up better. So I started to use my new Dyson and it's already dead. I didn't even get that far, but I said earlier that I used my Bissell and um, I vacuumed the whole place and I thought I did a really good job. It was clean. I mean, there's little things here and there that needed to be picked up again, but not really anything too bad. I thought I did a pretty good job. I used this for the video you'll see not a very long time and look at everything that's already in here look at that unbelievable that I thought my carpet was so clean because I vacuumed it earlier and this already I wish there was a better way to show you but this already has a bunch of stuff in it because this is just such a good quality vacuum and I really need to do my nails excuse my nails if you see them but um that's amazing how clean this is going to make my house um, so I'm going to charge this for a little bit and then I'm also shampooing my carpet because I don't think I've said it yet, but I'm hosting Christmas this year. We're working on because Christmas is not that far away now. We're it's November 30th today, so we have a lot of work to do and I really feel like with this, it's going to be super helpful because you want things to be really clean, especially when someone like my mom comes over who is a very clean person. I mean, you can't even, you have to use slippers or shoe covers to even walk in her home because she is just that clean. Um, and I am striving to be the same way as her. Okay guys, so I have recharged the Dyson. Not very long, cause I wanna just get this living room done because I'm shampooing it. So we will see how well it does like i said before i paused in three swipes it already really cleaned it well and i was very shocked and should have recorded myself taking the dumping all the stuff out maybe i will when i'm done with this because remember i already vacuumed today with my bissell and now i'm going over it with the dyson so we'll see how well pressure too much pleasure but not much to rely on your love ain't free it's killing me i want it to end oh cause i've been trying i've been waiting waiting for so long i'm waiting 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 Okay, so we revacuumed the whole living room. Yeah. Me and the silly girl behind me. <laughs> you have to show you this. I'm take that for me. I'm I'm shocked because honestly, we vacuumed earlier today. We vacuumed the whole vacuumed the whole living room. The whole living room. I vacuumed. I went over multiple times. I've never been able to get 
vacuum lines like I have right now on my carpet and they're not perfect so please don't judge me um but more surprisingly is the canister oops the canister which is now full from this one time use of the whole living room I vacuumed today that's not an exact I vacuumed with the Bissell little dirt devil vacuum over there which we've had for years so i'm not surprised that it's not really vacuuming well i'm just surprised that that's how much it left behind i'm totally shocked that it's that bad i mean i'm not really that shocked because honestly i'm not the best housekeeper in the world however i do vacuum occasionally and i really thought it wasn't this bad Okay, so this was the vacuum we had before, and you can see it's very full. Well, I don't know if you can really see that, but the canister is pretty full from vacuuming today. Um, well, and I haven't emptied it out in a while, I'm not going to lie. have not emptied it, but it's the Bissell Power Force Bagless Turbo Y Cleaning Path. So we've had this for quite a few years. So this has been in the family for a long time. It just, it doesn't do everything. There's my Vanna White showing it off. But it does not do what this Dyson vacuum just did in this living room. So... the living room all done um, we're gonna unattach this because it already died again as you can tell we did not it charge it long obviously dying to see me <laughs> yes it was so we didn't charge it that long I think I let it charge for a good hour but it's pretty full and I went over this living room a couple times now um, we got some beautiful can you excuse me besides her <laughs> We do have some beautiful vacuum lines that she is now going to destroy with her little child-like feet. Um, and I don't know if you noticed when I was vacuuming that there is some, some stuff underneath the couches. We still have to get all that done. Um, I'm going to take the couches out and sweep it, vacuum it, and then I'll put them back in place. I don't really need to shampoo underneath there because obviously no pets get under there. Um, it's just this main carpet area. Like 